Hi, I'm Coralie Wood. Yes, and I'm Charles Oliver. And we are... The Stage Queens. The Stage Queens. <laughs> Hello, lovely to see you again. Now, we're going to tell you about seeing a show this last week at Bateman's Bay. Wasn't that fantastic? It, very much different to stomp, I have to say. Well, they didn't stomp around so much because they were older ladies, really, weren't they? <laughs> <laughs> well, well, and of course the story wasn't about that either. No, I forgot to say what it was. It was yeah. the shoehorn sonata. Very well done, I thought. And of course, Bateman's Bay is such a beautiful little theatre. Look, we had a wonderful time. We drove down to Bateman's Bay. The sun was shining. Everything was wonderful, wasn't it? Oh, it was just gorgeous. Absolutely beautiful. I couldn't wait to get there and sit out in the balcony and have an, a refreshing glass of white wine <laughs> before we head off to the show. Yes, well, we did. Yes, and a $12 steak. It was just gorgeous. It was wonderful. At the yeah. Mariners, by the way. Oh, that's a good plug for the Mariners, isn't mm. it? Well, then we went to the theatre. Now, the theatre, they used to have a tiny little theatre on the top of a hill. They got rid of that, or oh, I think the council got rid of that. Yeah, it's a, it was a terrible shame too because I still love going up there, especially for the intervals, because usually it was better than the plays. Oh, look, that's dreadful. Well, it's I've view. got this, oops, I've got this great big cobra thing all around me here, and I'm going to hit you with that when you say something naughty, like. Oh, anyway. You're going to be very busy then. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, there we were and we went along to the show, the Shoehorn Sonata. Now, Bateman's Bay Theatre, or the Bay Theatre Players, as they're called, are in the Canberra Area Theatre Awards. That was one of the reasons we were there. The other one was to tell you all about the show. It's rather a sad show. It's all about a television studio and someone interviewing two ladies who had been in a POW camp. Yeah, but it's meant to be funny as well, remember? Well, it's not very funny being in a POW camp. No, but they advertise it? it as being funny. Oh, did they really? Yes, they do. Oh, I don't know whether I laughed. I thought the acting was fantastic. No, you didn't laugh at all. No, I didn't laugh. No, no. I had a couple of chuckles. I had a bit of a cry. Did you? Yes. Oh, yeah, yes. old softy. Oh, I am, aren't I? Yes. Yeah, it was a very miserable story, but, I mean, the two ladies did it quite well. They were in these terrible concentration camps in Indonesia during World War Two, and uh, they wasted way to nothing. Oh. Yes, mm. the Japanese got hold of them. That's why I'm wearing sense. red today. Red and black. Oh, I've got this great big thing stuck around my neck and it's very hot. We'll put that down. And, and that's why I'm wearing red, because it was all about the Japanese and all the bowing. I would have been no good because, well, I suppose by the time I'd have lost all that weight... I would oh, have you been able to bow. To yes, bowed. I would have snapped. Yes. Anyway, two actresses are only in it, and and a voice of a television person. You you don't actually see him. So and it's set in today's time. Yes, today's time. Which I found very, very um, a little bit uncomfortable. Did you really? Yes, because um, they were describing the atrocities that the Japanese what they went through with the Japanese and our relationship with the Japanese in 2009 is quite different. So I was wondering as I looked around the theatre if there are going to be any Japanese sitting in there because they would have been cringing, I would think. Yes, yes. Well, there weren't any Japanese there, but they were, they were older people who understood all about it. Oh, yes, we were the youngest there. I, I was, yes. <laughs> and anyway, then... These two actresses, and I have seen them before at Bay Theatre Players, they're wonderful. One of the ladies has won an award before this. Is that the big one? No, the little one. Oh, the okay, little one. Yeah. Now, I'm wondering about this story because you had a different feel on it, but it was sort of two ladies that loved each other in, in a, a loving way, like you love a mother and daughter. Yeah, not a lazy way. Not a Leslie way? No. No, mm. no but it was, it was quite... And you've got a warped mind if you think that's what it ended up as. No, because it well, didn't at all. I wasn't really sure. They were just reminiscing. They hadn't seen each other for 30 years or something or even more. That's right. One of them had never been married and one was, well, 
I think she was rather like that lady on YouTube, you know, that one that sings? I mean, she'd been a spinster all her life. Yeah, but she couldn't sing. Oh, no, she couldn't sing, no. no. And she was singing. Because they did have to sing in the show. Yes. And unfortunately, they couldn't sing. They couldn't sing, but, oh, they had lovely characters. And I had a tear in the eye. I was very pleased when Interval came. Oh, look, it would bring a tear to a glass eye. Yes, well, it was great at Interval because you could get a bit of a drink. Oh, and yeah. sort of think, aren't I lucky to be here in the bay and not in a Japanese war camp? No, but, but you have to talk about the set was, was, was quite was The very set was nice. fantastic. No, it wasn't. It was, very, it was very good for the show. It was a well, very clever design. I know, it was Japanese. Yeah, it was Japanese sort of rice, you know, like doorways yes. and all that sort yes, of stuff. Yes, no, that was very clever. I think, I can't remember who did the set, but whoever did it It was deserves. Candy. I was a candy. Yes. She's good. Don't you candy. read your program? Oh, well, you know, I'm now in front oh, of the Oh, she's too busy hot. when she gets back to the hotel room getting pissed and forgets all about it. <laughs> <laughs> but Candy's a lovely lady. She's the president of the Bay Theatre Play. She directed. She does everything. Yes. Now, I want to say to you out there that if you've got a company and you want us to come and see you, why don't you contact Channel Vision? They'd love to hear from you. I can't remember their email at the moment, but I'm sure they'll put it up. And we'll come all the way to wherever you are and have a look at your show. Maybe you can join the Cat Awards as well. There you are. And, and we'll talk really nicely about you too. Yes, we will. As we do. Even though there's some things that Charles doesn't like. And he says I get a little bit full, but... When I'm away, I'm allowed to get full, aren't I? And Charles does all the driving anyway, so it's fine. I'm on the phone all the time. And I do most of the drinking too when we get there. Yes, yeah. when we get there. Anyway, it's been lovely talking about this show. It's a great show and I think it's still on for another week and if you've got time to go and see it, please just find the Bay Theatre at Batemans Bay and it's gorgeous down there too. Oh, the sun was shining. And yeah, but it birds. won't be next week. The weather's terrible. The weather I looked at the weather forecast this morning to because our viewers would want to know what the weather will be like and it's gonna be hideous. Just shocking. Well, don't go. We know then. we say after Anzac Day, but that's the best time to go to the theatre when the weather's rotten outside. So you go to the theatre inside. And it's a beautiful theatre. The things they've done to it, they've got heating and cooling and cups of and tea. And they've got lights to yeah, do. They've got everything. It's a, it's a, actually <laughs> It's wonderful what the Bay Theatre players have done. Now, I think we'd better go because everyone's looking at us. Oh, OK. Then. And I'm well, getting very hot in my thing. We don't know what we're, um, we're going to... We're going to Wagga uh, this week, so we'll come back with something really exciting from Wagga. They do do fantastic stuff down there. And I'll try and find another one. Of but this is going to be a cabaret style, so she'll, she'll be, oh, she'll I be can fuller wear than it. ever. <laughs> <laughs> bye-bye. Bye. bye. <laughs>